So essentially what we're going to do here for this locked off shot is we're going to create a second layer and then we're going to use the draw mask tool to mask out a small area um, as close as we can get um, to this area of the wall here and then we can just nudge it into place and that will just uh, remove that spot okay so i'm going to first of all grab my clip on the timeline i'm um, using the selection tool hold down the alt key and just drag that up to create a duplicate of that clip so the next thing i'm going to do is just turn off the background clip just so we can see what's happening when we use the draw mask tool so i'm going to press the v key here here and i'm going to come to my effects and underneath my effects if you scroll down you should have your masks here and the draw mask so now i'm going to drag the draw mask on top and essentially what you'll get is this little message that says click to add a control point so i'm going to zoom in at this point to 200 percent and we'll just move up close to the the spot that we're going to remove and what we want to do is grab an area that's close to the color of this spot matches it as closely as possible and leave a little space between the spot and that color so i'm going to try for here and i'm just clicking and holding to draw out a shape so i'm essentially doing what you can do in illustrator drawing out a shape um, with the bezier mask and then what i can do now is once i've got that set up in my draw mask options up here just increase the feather of that so either increasing the feather by pulling it in or by coming out and i'm going to increase that and then i'm just going to drag these points just to kind of round that off at the edge there okay so now that I've got that, I'm going to turn my layer behind back on, okay, just by tapping the V key, come back up to this topmost layer, and then I'm going to come here below my clip to the transform tool. And now I'm just going to zoom out to around 50%. And what I can do now is move that spot over the top to repair that point, okay? Just click done here and zoom back into 200% because I think I need to just modify the feather here a little bit. So if we just tweak that until we get something that we're, we're happy with. Okay, so you can see the feather. Now if I toggle this layer on and off by tapping the V key, it's hiding that spot. Okay, and the closer you can get that selection to the, the spot in your camera, um, the better the, the repair will be. I hope you found that useful. Um, and uh, there's definitely a few scenarios where this is trickier to do, where you need to do things like animating uh, the movement of this. But actually in a locked off shot, it's relatively easy to do.